Well, today I had two bad RC servos to play with, two little cheapies that failed. I gave one to the inside view microwave, the second one, it's time to try out the capacitor bank. So, we're going to dump 6,000 volts from a 62 microfarad capacitor bank into the servo. How I've wired it is the negative lead of the servo goes to the negative of the bank, positive of the bank goes to positive of the servo, the servo signal lead is not connected. Let's see what, if anything at all, will happen. Will I just blow the wires off it, or will something actually happen to the servo? We'll see. Bank is charging, power off, and fire now. Well, something happened. Let's pick up the pieces and find out what. Well, according to the bank's voltmeter, the entire charge was dumped into the target servo. On this particular meter, you have to multiply the numbers shown on the meter screen by 200 to get the voltage. So a reading of 30 would be 6,000 volts. The servo actually wound up on the floor, about 5 feet away, with its leads completely gone. Let's pick it up and take a better look. The negative lead completely disappeared. I found the positive with the signal wire still attached to it, but the entire length of the negative has completely vanished. As far as the servo itself goes, where the wires entered it, Obviously something happened inside. The uh, plastic is badly cracked, as you can see near the two screws, and over to where the three-wire cable used to enter the servo. I don't think the servo will be causing me any more RC problems.